Hello everyone, it is Agony333, and it's time for some more Dark Wood. Last time we entered the Silent Forest, we had a fight with a fucking monster called a Savage. We broke through and we found our way to our hideout. We were trying desperately to set up shop, and uh, yeah, we ended up having enough to level up. We leveled up again, so we were basically level 2, but we are now in some sort of other place. Something has happened. Let's find out. So yeah, we are in a completely... Uh-oh. Yeah, check. I have nothing in my inventory. Just a military flashlight. So yeah, all of our items are gone. Yeah, all of our items are gone, guys. But we got a flashlight. Yeah, I have no idea why uh, we are here. What is exactly going on? So that is what we're seeking to find out. There's a corpse here. Let's search it. Nothing. Yeah, more dead ends. <clears throat> I don't know if this is a dream state or what the fuck. Shiny stone, huh? Come. Yeah, someone over there is saying come over there. We got a shiny stone. That uh totally uh puts me at ease for sure. And there's nothing there. What's behind us? Because you know when something says come, I should totally turn my back to it. Okay, there's nothing around here. This, it's a sort of underground place, kind of like the, another shiny stone, huh? Why do I feel like I'm following breadcrumbs to some fucking horrific creature? That's what it seriously feels like, guys. Okay, so this is like a, similar to an underground, un, to, similar to the underground, yeah, place. I don't know what's with these shiny stones. I doubt we'll even keep them, because I'm assuming we're in a dream state. Armored door. Let's examine the fucking armored door. Well, I... There we go. Now we examined it. It's 21, so yeah, that is it. So, press your ear against the keyhole. I can hear a faint voice throughout the howling wind. It sounds familiar. It seems to be coming through the keyhole. Someone is calling me. So this is just like what we did before. Let's look through the keyhole. Is that another ear? Or what the fuck is that? It looks like... To me, it looked like an ear or something. Like someone's listening to us. Come. Come to me. Oh, uh, the door is open. Come here. Uh, yeah. More shiny stones. Why do I feel like we should stay as far away from that as possible? But it's horror, guys. It's horror. So that means we gotta go there. Another goddamn shiny stone. And it is foggier than fuck. More shiny stones. So we gotta follow the voice, basically. The hell are those things moving? Another shiny stone? At least tell me I can keep these damn things. Is that like a, not a merry-go-round, but... Kind of like a playset type of thing. Hello? Is this water? And you can hardly fucking see anything. Even with this flashlight. Lamp. Switch on. Hey guys! Uh, how's it hanging? You don't, uh, you don't want to fuck up uh, your old friend Agony now, do ya? I mean, let's switch this fucking thing off. Yeah, let's keep that turned off. I think that's a lot better to just keep it turned the fuck off. All right, because I, I I don't know if we would if we would have walked onto those bodies if they would have hurt us or what, but uh, where's the way out here? God damn it! Probably not good to go this way. Uh, no, 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 no fucking way. Uh oh, get back to the fucking lamp. Can I get back to the fucking lamp? Where's that lamp at? Where's that fucking lamp at? Where's that fucking lamp at? I want to turn on the fucking light. 
I want to turn on the fucking light. Where's that goddamn fucking light? Jesus Christ. There we go. Uh, turn it the fuck on. Thank you. Okay, I am, uh... Walking all over these bodies. Do I have to turn it off? Like... I don't think I can really... Yeah, we have to turn that off, don't we? I don't want to go away from that. Oh, shit. Okay, wait, another shiny stone, okay. Are we in another different location now? This is incredibly confusing, I gotta say, but... But we're... It looks like we're in another location. Keep falling the shiny stones. Yeah, we are fully stocked of shiny stones now, guys. Shit, 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 shit. Run, 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 run. Oh god, we're fucked, guys. We're fucked this time, I think. Yeah, I don't know what this means, but we're running like fuck. I could not find the lamp. Oh, damn it. Oh, I hope I didn't fucking die. Okay, we woke up. We woke up from the fucking dream. I guess we had to... I guess we had to fucking die, guys. We, we fucking had to, and look. Can you tell what it is? It's it's getting to be nighttime now. But yeah, let me see here something. Um I'm not even sure how to select my fucking um not perks, but uh skills. Yeah, so we have the shadows and then eagle eye moth. Fuck. Okay, but we need to get this ready now because look, it is about to turn to dusk. So let's go and turn this on. Let's get back into our fucking shelter and hurry up to, to yeah, board the fuck up, basically, is what I'm going to do. I'm going to choose this room over here. I hope this table is enough. Um, yeah, I hope to God this table is enough. Come on. I don't know if a table's enough or not. Come on, can you please drag the other fucking way, please? Damn it, okay, I'm gonna... Try to turn it. Come on! There we go, come on. Look over here. Okay, yeah, drag it, please. There we go, okay, come on. Use that corner. Come on, you asshole! Okay, it is really pissing me off, guys. I'm trying to... Yes, there we go. Shit. Okay, there. That's, that's probably the best we're gonna do. Um... I'd like to try to drag this too, if possible. But I guess this is all we're gonna have, guys, to... to have here, is this damn thing. I don't even know if that's good enough, guys. I don't even know if that's good enough. I... I... Shit. And I'm not even sure how to use my perks. I'm gonna, I might have to look that one up for next time, because I want to know how to at least use my skills, guys. I need to at least know how to... how to use my skill. Oops, wrong button. Okay, that's how. So L1, you hold it down, and then I'm guessing I could select it. I don't want to use it. No. I don't think we use that. So yeah, if I hold L1 down, I can select them that way. Okay, so when I'm next to this, I can probably use it. But it is now finally becoming nighttime. Uh, we boarded up these fucking windows. And yeah. I was really hoping to be able to possibly move this damn thing. Because all I've got is a fucking table. But hey, it's, it's whatever. 
to fucking hell with it, guys. I mean... I think we'll be okay, or I hope we'll be okay. Okay, it is now nighttime. Let's just hide in this fucking corner. Like a scared motherfucker. And hope that, uh, Hideout 2 is... Okay. And that I've done enough. You know, if I was smart, I would probably... Have done other things, but... Hey, guys, I'm not that smart, am I? But we have one bandage, a very good bandage, and we have our perk to use on that light if we need to. So let's ride out the fucking night. Let's try to ride out the fucking night, guys. Actually, I have an idea now. Um, let me... Because I still don't know what we use the flares on, but let me get the flares out. Just in case uh, we go up against whatever we need to use those flares on. Oh, you hear that? Something was walking around. Yeah, someone's totally walking around. I gotta hope that that table holds it back. If something's in here. But thankfully our board of nails is a heightened damage one. Yeah, hopefully when I hit L, if I have to, I can hit L1, it'll pause for a moment, so I can use that perk to heal myself. That's what I'm hoping. So really, that perk may come in very good handy, not just for the daytime to heal whenever, but particularly for the nights, because since I'll be next to this electrical thing, you get what I'm saying? It'll be basically a free heal whenever we get attacked or something, if that happens. Uh-oh, 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 look at that. Something's trying to get in. You see that thing, like, writhing on the floor over there? So, yeah, something is really trying to get the fuck inside. And, uh, the table so far is holding it back? I really hope you continue to hold it back, Mr. Table. You will be my best friend if you do so. And is that more things coming in? Is there more than one thing coming in? Oh no, there's birds everywhere. What the fuck in hell? Is it that thing from before? Because remember that thing appeared and uh and birds came when that thing appeared. So I wonder if that other creature thing has fucking appeared and is summoning birds. But thankfully it has not appeared in here, I don't believe. Because we'd be seeing it right now if it appeared in here. We just gotta hope Mr. Table, uh, stays strong. Mr. Table, please stay strong. What the fuck is this? Uh, use it. Use it. I don't know if that's what we need or not. I don't know if that's the thing. But use the goddamn thing. I have no idea, guys. If uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fuck you. Jesus Christ, I can hardly see. Okay, you use it. No, use it. Can I select that? Use it, asshole. Did it use? What the fuck is all this around me? Jesus Christ, run, 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 run. Okay, I don't even think I used my perk, did I? Fuck! 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 Jesus Christ! There are things everywhere. Every fucking where. Run back into that fucking room, you dumb shit. Agony. Back into that fucking room. Oh my god, no. Fuck you. Fuck you too. Oh, it's a... A ban... A dead banshee baby? Wait, what? Who goes there? Who the fuck is going there? Something busting through? Okay, the window barricade has been busted open. How the fuck did I survive that? Oh! Fuck you! They so almost had me. Holy fuck. Oh, fuck you! You, you bitch! Fuck off, asshole! Shit! 
No, 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 don't die. Fuck. We almost have it. Come on. Come on. Don't you fucking kill me. Oh my god. Did we make it? Is it gone? It's daytime. Day eight. We had like one sliver left. Are we... Holy shit. Yeah, we gained reputation. We, we damn well should. We somehow survived that. Holy fuck. Holy fucking fuck, people. Can you... Oh my god, I did not... I, I'm telling you the truth. I honestly did not expect to make it through that. Because we were fucking swarmed. I don't know what was going on. I don't know if that flare helped with that thing that was like... Okay, let me go turn that fucking generator off before I forget. And see how much fuel's in that damn thing. Yeah, there's the traitor. We earned some shit with him. But holy shit, guys. Okay, no, that... We need more fuel for that. Whew! Okay, we... Like I said, we somehow survived that. That perk, I think, did help us. I think it helped us very well. But holy fuck, man, that was insane. So what I'm thinking is that I think that one thing that almost killed us was a savage that, that came through there. The table got fucking knocked across the room. Here, let me, let me drag it out of this room. I really wish we had another item other than a table to try to barricade with. I, I don't know if, a tub, if that tub over there would work better. I have, I have no idea what would work better. Yeah, I want to try to get this out of here. It, it, it worked for a little bit. Yeah, that works pretty good. Okay. Whew, I'm sorry, guys. I'm still trying to recover from mind being blown here. But yeah, let me see if I... I'm going to re-barricade that. So yeah, that got busted down. Yeah, these are still barricaded. I think I'll try again in this room. That light was off. Um, okay, uh, okay, good. We have a replacement flare for me dropping that one. I really hope I didn't just waste a damn flare. That's what I'm hoping I didn't do. These pills heal. I'll have to remember that when I run out of, um, when I run out of fucking health. But we didn't have to use it, thankfully. Yeah. I really want a gun, though. I gotta say. After having a night like that, but yeah, okay, what I was gonna say is, I think that a savage is what was over here trying to break through. And I think, um, since that was a banshee baby, it looked like a bird. I don't know if, if the thing that appeared before that summons those crows is called a banshee or not. But, um, I'm guessing that that thing appeared somewhere in the house and was summoning all those little things. Because I think uh, if you're in the whole mess of it, I think the big one was coming at me. I think I attacked her out, ran her or something, and its babies came after me. And thankfully, I clobbered the babies and just barely got away from that savage. Like, I managed to survive till daybreak, but holy fuck. Okay, so... Yeah, I cleared out that shelf. Now I'm trying to kind of use my time to uh, fully explore this place. Because if you guys remember, I kind of, like quickly went through and didn't get a full chance to just close this goddamn thing. And I almost want to barricade that. There's so many holes in the fucking place. Yeah, that lamp was there. Oh, I think I realized what was going on when I used that moth uh, thing, that skill. Is it able to be used again? I don't, I don't fucking know. But yeah, when I think I used that, it only worked while I was standing next to the lamp. So when I ran from there and got lucky and this lamp was over here, uh, I think I was still healing when I was over here. I'm not sure, but... Search this damn wardrobe. Okay, bread. Don't know what the fuck bread does. Okay, there's clothes on the floor. Ration stamps. So these are old rations, basically? Not entirely sure. We got another fucking rag. All right. Yeah, now I feel like now is a good time to fully search this fucking place. Now that we have the time. Okay. There's that traitor. 
search this wardrobe. Okay, alcohol. Good. You know why good, guys? Because this is what I want to fucking do. I want to use some of these rags to make bandages. And now I want to make another bandage with alcohol to replace the ones I've used. So yes, now I've got two of those. Which is good. Okay. Yeah, since we basically rushed in here and didn't have time, I figure it's good. But this this is actually... You know what I'm going to do, guys? I don't know if anyone gets annoyed that... You know, I... Don't know I'd say I leave this in here, but... This is what I'm going to do. I am going to fucking move this goddamn fucking wardrobe. I want this thing. I don't want that stupid fucking table. I want a goddamn wardrobe. So that is exactly, precisely, what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna move this fucking wardrobe into here so I'm prepared for the next night. Because I feel like that table kind of fucked us a little bit. I feel like we would have been better off with, uh... With this blocking the damn wall. Than that table. So I apologize, Mr. Table. But you can kindly, uh, go and fuck yourself. You did not help me for shit, Mr. Table. So I actually have an idea here. I have a very good idea. At least I hope it's a good idea. I'm gonna still bring Mr. Table in. You know why I'm gonna bring Mr. Table in? I'm gonna bring Table inside the fucking... ...room. I wish I could get these fucking pots out of here, or whatever that is. I'm gonna bring Table in here. And I'm going to put table in front of this fucking window. So that way, when this window gets bashed down, there will be a fucking table in front of this window. I don't know if that'll offer extra protection, as in something that it might have to push out of the way or something. I don't know exactly. And I may very well just take the table and put it up against here. I don't know. But now what we will do is from now on, we will use this wardrobe. We'll use this wardrobe as our door. Basically. We'll make... We'll put... We'll pull the fucking wardrobe to block this. We'll have that door barricaded and that in front of it. And this will be the only window that they can basically bust through and that I can... You know, swing swing on them with. Basically. That seems like a good idea to me. Because, yeah, the table got knocked the fuck out after just a, bu a bit. It got knocked the fuck out. And actually... Was it another fucking table? No, it's another wardrobe. Damn it, wardrobes. Ugh. I'm, I was trying to see if maybe I can... I should I should probably eventually drag one of those and try to maybe barricade one of these. Like, I don't know. I'm trying to set up to where it's a lot harder for things to get through. Because, yeah, I don't know if it was just this hideout or if we just got unlucky, but it seems like uh, hideout 2 is harder to survive in than the fucking regular goddamn hideout. And yeah, I have yet to even talk to him, but I could give a fuck less. Okay, we can search the tractor. Good, we got some more gasoline. And a, a fan belt. Alright. And I can't... Okay, yeah, there's nothing in there. And did we search all this shit? Okay, we did not grab everything in here. Grab those. And these. Good, we, we finally... Yeah, we searched it, but we need to clear it out. Okay, there's more mar large mushrooms. No room in inventory. Shit, I forgot about that. So this is what we're going to do, guys. This is probably stupid, but since this is our new abode, our new place, we are going to fucking go crazy. And by go crazy, I mean we are going to fill the ever-living fuck out of this. So that way we don't have to re even remember or focus on this shit for the next foreseeable nights. Because I imagine we're going to be here for quite a while. And we have several other gas tanks in case we need more gas for shit. Let's just do that. That basically means we'll be good for two nights and then some. So let's use this extra space to get more large mushrooms. Because I want to level up again for another perk. Because I feel like that's going to help us tremendously. Okay, so yeah. Look around here. We already searched that. We already grabbed these mushrooms. Okay, that was that door. Never fucking mind me. Sofa to drag. And was there anything in here I did I missed out on? Okay, that was locked. I don't know if we'll ever find the key to that. 
Okay, here we go. Okay, another rag, which is very useful. I think it's time to sell, basically. Yeah, we basically, I think, cleaned out house and everything like that. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I am going to end this episode now. I'm going to end this episode now. And what I'll do is I'll do my selling and, and shit like that off camera so that way you guys don't have to fucking sit here. I apologize if it annoyed you seeing me kind of like figure out my plan on how I want to barricade and whatnot. I mean, I don't know what anyone enjoys, but like I told you guys, I want to take this series slow, really get the most out of it and enjoy it. I don't want to feel rushed and whatnot because I absolutely love this game. It's extremely addicting and it's 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 consistently, um, I don't know if I'd say terrifying, but I mean, it has moments like that for sure, but it has a consistent feeling of dread and just, it has a really great feel to it. I can't explain it, but it has a great feel to it. And yeah, I don't want to rush through that. I want to really take my time with it, enjoy every second I've got with this playthrough and with this game. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. To me, this is a pretty action-packed video. We went through a crazy sort of dreamlike state. And then, uh, yeah, a really crazy, intense fucking night that I am so surprised we survived. I thought our first death was going to come there. But yeah, we still basically haven't died because I don't think I count that dream state as dying. But, uh, yeah, we somehow survived with a sliver left of health. That savage almost had us. But yeah, if you're enjoying this series, if you like Darkwood, you want to see more Darkwood, like, comment, subscribe for more. I'm most definitely going to keep pressing on. But we are finally in the silent forest, and, and shit is ramping up. But we have not even yet begun to explore the silent forest yet. I'm not sure exactly what we're going to tackle in the next episode, but I will figure that out, and we will see what happens next time. So yeah, like, comment, subscribe if you like Darkwood, and I hope you're all having a great, wonderful day. I will see you next time, guys. Zagony333 signing out. Have a great one. Peace, folks.